Hi, this is Lisa Matthews from Positive Practice Training and Behavior Consulting. And one of the things that people don't realize is when you have used positive reinforcement training um, to train your dog, you can use that in so many different ways. These are my two dogs, Patrick and Jilly. Patrick is the tall white dog and Jilly is the short brown dog. And Jilly had a rotator cuff injury and this is after she's went through, she went through rehabilitation at a center. She did the underwater um, treadmill. And another thing that she did, her therapist had her do something called Cavalettis, which is spacing, lifting up her feet um, and stretching forward a certain amount of distance apart and doing that repetitiously. They had this Cavalettis um, piece of equipment at the facility and um, we got the measurements and built it for home use because they said if she keeps doing this um, it'll just help you know it'll help her get better quicker you don't want to overdo it but you want to do it just enough so because we had done positive reinforcement training with her and taught her um, in this way she really enjoyed doing her cavalettis and of course we mixed in some you know basic obedience commands to help her have more fun with it. So this is what it looked like. Oh, that's a nice up. Uh, with a sit? Hey, beans. With a sit. 